I despise traffic. What I wouldn't give to never have to wait at another stoplight again. What if you did it? Whoa, who are you? And how did you get into my car? I'm here from the future. And the door was unlocked. Huh, cool. What did you say about no more stoplights? That sounds too good to be true. It's not too good to be true. It's called a roundabout. Oh, so like things they have all over Europe? Exactly, but we're bringing them to Texas. With Dallas being named one of the most dangerous cities to drive in, these can be an important tool to increase the safety of driving in our communities. Roundabouts have the power to reduce fatalities and intersection accidents by 90%. So with the way you drive, you need all the help being safe that you can get. Hey, that was rude and I- Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me tell you though, autonomous vehicles are gonna be a game changer for you. Roundabouts also are good for the environment and not just you. By reducing cars accelerating, decelerating, and the time that they spend idling, they can be instrumental in helping reduce air pollution and reduce emissions. Not to mention, they also provide an aesthetic quality to them. With those little islands in the middle being able to provide a home for native plants or maybe local artwork, they can also make our communities not only safer but more beautiful. This sounds great, but it will probably cost a fortune. Roundabouts can actually be quite affordable without the electronics used in traffic lights. Awesome! Your mission, if you choose to accept it, is to make roundabouts more widespread. I think I'll accept. Next stop, talking to traffic and land planning. All right, I've got a blast, but hopefully I'll see you in the future where it's a little more well-rounded.